Um, hi, this is uh, Tom Rexwell and this is just a quick vid um, showing my pastel mail. Um, it's the day after now, it's the morning, it's about 10 o'clock over here. Um, uh, yeah, so I'm just seeing if she's got a. Um, she's in a kit, she's got a water bowl, she's got a repti bark on the bottom, she's got a hide. I'm going to get some leaves today, so. Uh, aim, sorry, I don't know why I call her. But as you can see, she's definitely pastel. This is like in the natural light kind of. Mm. And anyway, yeah, the lucky thing is um, um, I'm able to borrow some money off somebody, um, a close friend of mine. And um, so I might even be getting my second today. Um, so it's really good because what I'm going to do is I'm going to buy an, a normal female and uh, just mate them straight away. Um, but instead of that, um, I was talking to him about it and he reckons that it's better if I get a better one like a spider or a fire. Um, so that when I, if I breed this to a female one of them, I could either get some fireflies off a fire female. Or if I get, if I, um, get a spider female, which I want, I can get some bumblebees. <coughs> Excuse me. So that's what I want to aim towards. So as you can see he's, he's a bit um he's a bit nervous um i mean he, he, he kills up a lot he's not a very you know he's not it's not bad he's nice i don't know if that's a striking position or he's just curling up into that position or what but as long as you grab him from behind and stuff like that he won't bite and as you can see Got some nice reduced pattern. Like I like tell you, like um, say it's not very daytime yet, it's still dull. Um, so I just like him a lot. Put him back in. Yeah, so I really like him. Um, so yeah, um, I might even be getting my second ball python today. Um, um, you know, much appreciation for the person that's landed at me. Um, he's a really good friend of mine, like I say, so. And I'm gonna pay him back once they've had, you know, the eggs and I've sold them and stuff, so. That's good. I wanna go there to get a. a what's it called? A spider um, female to get some. Um, really, to get some. Um, what they call it now? Um, bumblebees, because it's pastel, she's spider, so I produce some bumblebees. But, um, I've heard that if you breed one of these to a fire, you can get some fireflies. Now, I don't know how good they are, or, you know, how expensive they are or anything like that. So, if anyone knows if they're better than bumblebees, you know, tell me. But personally, I just like the local bumblebees, they're just really nice. So, even if um, the fireflies might be more expensive, I'll still be going there looking for the spider female. But if I can't get it... Then as a last resort, I might get a fire. Um, if anyone else can suggest any more, um, not cheap, but not overpriced, um, you know, around the two pound mark. And I think that in US dollars is about three hundred dollars. So if anyone can uh, tell me any more, the you know morphs that they suggest I could get and breed with a uh, pastel and get some good things out of. Like I say, I want a, I want a spider because I want a bumblebee, but I'll, I've found out I can get a fire and that'll get some fireflies but you know it'd be really helpful if people could tell me a bit more a few more morphs that can make certain stuff that's around that price range so that'd be really good yeah so this is uh, Tom Rick's Bar and if you want to see any room of the animal just send me a message I'll get that up straight away and yeah um, I might even be getting my, uh, my own uh, female today and trying to start the breeding project straight away um, and it'll obviously help me if people can send messages of other snakes because if I go there and they haven't got the snakes that I want I'll be still looking for one of the same value that can produce some nice babies so if you want to see some babies and eggs and you know stuff like that um, send your messages in to me about you know other stuff like other snakes that are around that price range uh, $300 £200 in UK and yeah um, I'm really excited to be uh, into the you know 
the projects of uh, breeding pole pythons, like I said, I've already told you. Um, I've already got another tank set up. And like I said, once I get my um, once I get my uh, rack system sorted out, they'll be in like tubs, kind of like this one, or a bit bigger. Yeah, probably the next size up. But for now, as you can see, you know, ball pythons don't use mega amounts of room, but I'll probably just go, you know, with the next size up, so 20 litre or quart or whatever it is. Um, actually, I think this is that. Um, anyway, yeah, so that's basically it. So uh, it'll really help um, if you could send the uh, messages in of other uh, morphs that are around that price range that I can get to breed certain stuff. Because at the moment, I'm only going there uh, that I know of to get uh, either a spider female or a fire female because I know they both make somewhat good uh, with the pastel but I don't know of anything else so if you know of anything of any morphs that are in the price range <coughs> um, like I say I'll be I'll be getting like anything if cinnamons are around that price range or whatever because I want, I want one of them really so you know I'll need some uh, like second and third options so it'd be really helpful if you could send that in and uh, yeah I showed you my snake yesterday, um, this is just it now, um, so yeah, if you want to see more of our animals, just send me a message, uh, rate, comment, subscribe, um, that's it, uh, Tomic409, uh, stay tuned for more videos, bye.